It is this shift in consciousness from the alienation of the limited, finite ego mind that lives in paranoia and confusion and chaos to the clarity, the presence, the love, the peace, the power of the infinite supreme self that will permit a renaissance of life on our world rather than the extinction of a species that has lost its true nature. May we confer upon ourselves the blessing of living in truth, which is to live in love and to live in peace and to live in silence and to live in that inner light and power that requires no affirmation of another no completion by another, but that can transmit that power of wholeness that is the holy grail that every being seeks. To be able to see the one self in the gaze of the other, who has no ulterior motives of desire and no fear and no territoriality or desire to possess or control or dominate or oppress or exploit, but to live in natural harmony with all that is. It is the learning of this one lesson That is the point of being in community and of facing the truth that the one requirement of our maturity and growth and survival is to overcome the egocentric illusion that alienates us and turns us into objects rather than the manifestations of the one self who is sacred, inviolable, and pure with the impeccable, precious nectar of eternal love. We are that. May we live as that. May we share that. May we embody that and may we create a culture that produces that and gives it freely to all.